All right guys, Haskell HD here, and today what I'm going to be bringing you is basically just obviously what everyone else is doing at the moment. FIFA 14 gameplay, this is obviously the demo. Um, sorry about not uploading lately, I've just started um, my new sixth form, so I just wanted to make sure I got everything sorted out there, and then I thought I'd upload. And obviously with FIFA 13 dying, I didn't really have anything to upload to you guys, because I'm sure you guys didn't really want to didn't really want to see a squad builder from FIFA 13 when the hype is all about 14. So I just left it for a few days, waited for the demo to come out. Uh, I didn't get home last night till about eight, so I can uh, seven eight seven or eight, so I couldn't actually give you guys a video. So sorry about that. Um, but I did. This is the first game I ever played, and to be fair, it seems a little bit di a lot different to FIFA 13. I mean, from what I've played so far, strength is very 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 important I mean um, the stronger defenders this year will be very a lot more effective should I say than what they were in previous years players such as PK, Vidic, Hummels they'll be extremely good because they're tall they're not extremely quick but they're very 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 strong which will mean they'll be able to definitely budge the defenders off the ball and keep the ball under challenge as well and that will be better for the uh, Probably the slower strikers who have strength. Um, obviously, Akin Femmer is actually the strongest player on the game. EA released uh, last night, um, but you could have looked at that on FUT head. But obviously, strength is going to be very important in the midfield. If you have a very strong defence, they're just going to boss the game and keep the ball. And um, apparently, finesse shots are very overpowered. I haven't actually tried many of them myself, but Sandro they have a nice slotted finish into the bottom corner. And Pace doesn't seem as important, but in, as important as it, it, it was um, on FIFA 13, which is uh, can only be a good thing because you're not going to get those 3-5-2 Bundesliga sweat teams or Brazilian teams, and they won't be as effective, effective as last year. So obviously that can only be a good thing, and um, you no longer need to hold down the button to do the skill moves, which caught me out in this game, being my first game, me not reading instructions, being a typical guy. Um, just not reading the instructions and thinking I know everything and obviously if you actually read the instructions and controls and that you might actually know <clears throat> that you didn't need to hold the button down but um, apart from that I think it's a very it seems alright maybe just a few little problems in the game where uh, there are a few little glitches in the demo which you hope will get sorted out but overall the gameplay looks like it could suit uh, possession football a lot more than it did on FIFA 13 holding on to the ball with the now what was the skill button being able to hold on to the ball could be very very effective this year um, obviously you do only get to choose a select few teams it'd be a, a, a selected few teams on the demo so you don't know how all the players are gonna be but Defoe here wasn't very quick and I mean he's got 83 pace I believe so Pace obviously isn't, and it has an important factor there. Hummels just barging him off the ball, even though it did go out uh, for offside. Hummels, look, if you, Hummels started before, managed to turn very quickly, and Defoe had no chance because Hummels was shielding that ball, and Defoe wasn't getting anywhere near that whatsoever. So, like I said, strength and passing looks like it could be very important. Uh, they've taken out the skill dribbling. Well, not taking it out completely, but they've changed it quite a bit. Now with the shielding of the ball, it's not as easy as it was before but I didn't really do that much um, only against people who liked to contain or um, just hold you in a position you could do it for them to get past but apart from that the demo seems pretty nice if you do want to see any more gameplay of it be sure to tell me in the comments and I can give you some more of this this is just my opinion on it so far um, if you have enjoyed it please be sure to leave a like if you are new to me please be sure to follow me on twitter if you are new as well to me please be sure to subscribe it really does help me out i'll be bringing out a lot more videos because i'm getting the early access to fifa 13 so i'll be bringing you all the squad builders i do from that and a few little pack openings and things like that so I, if you have enjoyed it please be sure to leave a like check me on twitter subscribe to me if you're new and i shall see you guys later goodbye